neutrality was a hot button topic just a few years ago. With it, internet service providers are not allowed to intentionally slow down, block, or charge money for stuff online. All internet was treated equally by law until net neutrality was repealed by the FCC in 2017, leaving room for internet companies to decide what you can and cannot see. Let's say Netflix doesn't want Hulu to be available in North Dakota. Okay, so Netflix gets a hold of Midcontinent and says, you know what, we'll give you $50 million and you have to turn off Hulu. They might look at $50, 50 million dollars and go, oh my goodness, we won't allow our customers now to have Hulu. Local tech expert Marlo Anderson says he hasn't seen any notable instances of internet companies taking advantage of the net neutrality rollback yet, but he expects it will happen as time goes on because there's nothing stopping it from happening. He says he sees the advantage from a business owner's perspective, especially for smaller internet providers, but he's a strong believer in restoring net neutrality. He says anyone could influence the internet for the right dollar amount, including government organizations, religious groups, you name it.